Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'll be talking to you about this 2009 Mercedes-Benz ML320 CDI. It's an update, so it's got the much newer steering wheel dash lights and wheel package. It's obsidian black with soft black leather interior and it's absolutely beautiful. It's done just 85,000 kilometres. Every single service done on this car up to date has been done at a Mercedes-Benz dealership and it's in immaculate condition. It's got the vision pack so it's got Harman Kardon sound system, xenon headlights and a sunroof. It's got memory electric seats on the drivers and passenger side. It's got that beautiful soft leather. You can generally tell because it's got this perforated section just in the middle of the front seats. Uh, reverse camera, navigation and Bluetooth. But it's a car which really needs to be seen to be appreciated. It's just in such lovely condition. It's got Pirelli tyres all around. Pirelli Scorpions, which are the perfect tyre for this car. They're nice and quiet, great in the dry, but they're also good if you know, you're on dirt roads and things or in the snow. It's one of those cars I look at and I think, you know, why, why can't there be something like this available when I buy a car? You know, to be able to find something like this with two keys, immaculate condition, low kilometres, every service at Mercedes, and a great set of tyres is, is pretty rare. You know, like for me, whenever I buy a car, often, you know, I've got to put new tyres on it straight away. It's overdue for a service. It has a panel or two that needs to be painted or repaired, but this is just not one of those cars. And I'm sure if you went online and went price low to high, I'm sure there's a cheaper car, but it's not going to be 85,000 kilometres in this condition. And in 2010, they rebadged as the ML350. They're essentially the same car with a different badge. Uh, it does have an electric boot. It's one of those cars, uh, there's no dog hair in it, so it, which sounds like a strange thing to say, but you know, if you've had a big dog in the boot for five years of ownership or 10 years, whatever it is, it's unfortunately a smell you'll never, never get rid of. And no matter how many times you clean it, you'll keep finding those hairs. Now, I'm not saying there's anything wrong with having a dog. I'm just saying if you're buying a car, you'd probably prefer to buy one where the previous owner hasn't. It's got roof racks, side steps, and really is just in every way an impressive car. The leather's beautiful in this model. It actually, my wife's car's got uh, Nappa leather and it looks exactly the same and feels exactly the same. Um, rear air conditioning controls in the back. It's been garaged its whole life. The engine bay is nice and clean. Again, it's one of those cars which came in, we also had to do was wash it with soap and water. And that's it. It's got parking sensors front and back. <coughs> so it's got the original Mercedes-Benz mats as well. So just in, basically to wrap it up, it's got a nice set of Pirelli tyres, full Mercedes history. It's been serviced at least every year. It's got the two original keys, got some great options like your Xenon lights, sunroof and Harman Kardon. Parking sensors, obviously a standard. Reverse camera, Bluetooth is great, very good colour, and the condition is excellent. Even the wheels, you know, pretty much every car we get, and look, it's not a big deal, but basically every car we get needs wheel repairs. You know, it's been scratched on it, scraped on a gutter. You know, just about every car has that issue, and then cars come in like this and then they're, they're fine. But yeah, it hasn't been parked in the sun. It's just a very impressive car. Yeah, the steering wheel's nice and tight. I find often if they've been parked in the sun, the top of the steering wheel gets very loose. 
the glue obviously goes off being in the sun. Basically it's got the 3 litre turbo diesel engine with the 7 speed gearbox so you've got plenty of power. And with these diesels, I know people think it's diesel, it's like a truck, it'll go forever, you don't have to service it, whatever. Um, they must be serviced regularly at least every year like this car has. And the good thing about this car is because it's had such a good history up to date, it's up to you. People say, oh, how long will it go for? How long will it last? Well, it depends on how often you service it and how you look after it. You've got a very good car here, and it'd be great to keep it in this condition mechanically. And as I said, I'm sure there's cheaper cars out there, but you, know, you can't buy an inferior car or a cheap car which maybe hasn't been serviced properly and make it good. It's either a good car or it's not. And this is a good car. I've seen two or three ML320 diesels with over 300,000 kilometres. One, in fact, came up for sale with 430,000 kilometres. That's obviously been looked after. Um, too many kilometres for us uh, to sell from here, but uh, very impressive all the same. Thanks for watching our video. We are the Old Timer Centre. We're located in Marrickville. We're only 15 to 20 minutes from Sydney Airport. Um, we can help you with finance. If you are interested in this car and you've been looking for a good one like this for a while, I would suggest leaving a deposit subject to seeing the car if you're coming from a distance or if you're interstate. Or if you're interstate, we can simply just sell it to you and send it to you. Thanks again for taking the time. We look forward to hearing from you soon.